Hello and welcome to Yogg's Cast 2. It just so happens I've got Assassin's Creed 3. Uh, Ubisoft were very kind and sent me off with a copy of the game. So I've got it on the day of uh, US release, which is pretty cool. Uh, so yeah, let's start this, uh, let's start the playthrough. I am going to play it all the way through because holy shit, yes. So let us get this shit on. We're now going to hear a quick foreword by John Delancey, a.k.a. Q, a.k.a. Desmond's dad. Enjoy. Used to be when people talked about the end of the world, we locked them up or laughed them off. Sometimes both but we never took them seriously. Maybe we should have. But I'm getting ahead of myself. Better to start at the beginning with the abduction of Desmond Miles, my son. This boy had no ambition, no direction, no plans for the future. What he did have was a heritage, one he chose to deny. It nearly cost him his life. He was captured and imprisoned. Those who took him believed he could help them find something. The apple. One of several artifacts we call pieces of Eden. Bits of ancient technology scattered across the globe. Some hidden, some found, all of them dangerous. Most are held by a single group, the same group that now had Desmond. You know them as Abstergo Industries. We know them as the Templars, as the enemy. We've been fighting them for thousands of years. Even longer if you believe the stories of their origins. I do. After all, I've seen the truth. That's the beauty and the horror of the Animus. A device that allows us to enter and experience the lives of our ancestors. It holds the power to change everything, to show us history the way it really happened. Up until its creation, to the victor went the spoils, went the truth. We're trying to fix that, to free minds and bodies both. But there's only so much that we can do, and the Templars have the upper hand these days. But something larger than the Assassins and Templars is approaching, bigger than all of us. And if we can't find a way to stop it, these next few weeks will probably be our last, everyone's last. In the end, it all comes down to him, to Desmond. Through the Animus, he discovered his heritage, explored the lives of his ancestors, and uncovered their secrets. When that was done, he trained. He used another ancestor to provide decades of experience in the span of a few days. It worked. We think. We hope. Soon, though, soon we'll know that ominous date fast approaches, December 21st, 2012. None of us knows what it'll bring. It's the uh, Mayan calendar, for those of you who don't know what the fuck that means. They've been guiding us in their own fractured, frustrating way. These voices from the first civilization, the ones who came before, a precursor race of immense power and uncertain motives. They're the ones who made the pieces of Eden. This is where they've led him, and through him, us. He stands at the entrance to this long lost place, armed with the knowledge of Altair and the abilities of Ezio. He holds in his hands the apple of Eden, and we stand at his side, ready to support him however we can. His name is Desmond Miles, and he has brought us to the end. God, his face is a bit weird. I think he's lost weight. Good old Desmond's lost weight. He's always looked a bit derp, like, no matter what they do to him, I think it's just his face looks a bit derp. Um, I don't know what it is. I have no idea why he looks derp. But he always looks derp to me, uh, which is a bit weird. We're going on a ride in a van. This is a loading screen. Um, and I believe that that man on the right is uh, my father, or Desmond's father. I keep saying my, I'm gonna get myself confused, especially when Connor gets involved. But we're driving to a secret place. It'll be cool. Oh, it's Halloween. It is Halloween. We're here. Oh, thank you. Okay. I don't know where here is, but there's a cave. We have boxes. Let's go. Are you an assassin? Oh, 
are you just a, a member of the... Oh, I've got a glowy thing on my, my waist. Oh, I like his bag. It's like my bag. If you don't know what bag I'm talking about, it's on my Twitter somewhere. I've got a... a uh, mohawk styly bag with Assassin's Creed on. It was amazing. I am using it every day. <laughs> What is this? Oh god, um... Where did you pull that from? Was that... in your bag? Oh, okay, it goes in the hole. In another moment, down went Alice after it, never once considering how in the world she was to get out again. We like our Alice in Wonderland quotes, don't we, Ubisoft? Uh, I think Far Cry uses them as well. I guess it's quite apt for going into a strange new world. Okay. God, it's dark. I hope you aren't expecting me to do anything assassin -y. in a giant cave system and the PlayStation seems to be struggling quite a lot. It'll be fine when it gets into it. Oh my god, what the bugger are we doing? I think we're here. Buggering hell. Oh, shitting. Oh, God. Um, can I get my light back? No, I've lost my light. Oh, I can run. Oh, here we go. Beautiful. Come on, then. Off we go. Ah, oh, I love it. I love the new free running. Just press one button. You don't have to press two. What is that? Is it dangerous? Is it? Is it? Oh no! It's part of a, part of a computer. Has it fallen out? Oh my god! Oh. Uh, oh god. Um. What have you done? Oh, everything's switching on. It's, it's certainly blue. Um, oh, I'm having a moment. You must find the key. Okay, nice lady. Son. Oh, shit, hello. Um, Sir. Oh, God. What the, what the bugger? <sighs> Here we go again. Oh, Jesus. I had a spaz. Desmond? Hello. Do you hear us? Yes. Uh, yeah. What happened? The temple triggered a bleeding effect. You collapsed and entered into a fugue state. Oh, good. Good, I'm glad. So naturally, you dropped me into the Animus instead of, I don't know, making sure I was okay? You weren't in any danger. Besides, the temple appeared to be communicating with you. And I didn't want to risk severing the connection. Oh, yeah, I bet. At least not until we knew what it wanted. Huh. Right, of course. Son, I... No, it's fine. I get it. And I know what I'm looking for, by the way. Do you? It's a key. A key could oh, be anything. It. It's not, I know what I'm looking it's for, you strange be. man. She? Juno, Dad. She's talking to me. 
Okay, Desmond. While you were, uh, visiting Constantinople, we picked up a software update for the Animus. Of course you did. Of course you did. Let's start the tutorial. All right. What do you need me to do? We'll start simple. Walk to the marker over there. Okay, sure. Do, 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 do. I know how to run. I've done this before. So the new change to the game is you just hold one button, you don't hold two. Okay, Desmond. Let's practice climbing on these objects. So you just uh, climb up, it's all cool. And up you go. Come on, Desmond. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Oh, There we go up. That's right. We go along here. And we go up. And we go along here. That's it. Oh, good lord, you're getting much more agile. Free run your way through this little obstacle course. Sure. I know what I'm doing, crazy mare. I can free run this. I was born to free run this. Oh, lord. That's a constraint. These are optional objectives that raise your synchronization rate. All right, Desmond. Follow the on-screen instructions and kill the two Templars. There we go, out onto the, the ledge. And there we go. Huh. And there we go. Do, 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 do. And then lock on. Okay, we don't need to lock on. That's fine. We'll just own his face. All you have to do here is jump the gap. Okay, well, that's easy. Jump! Oh! Oh, God! Now where? Oh, oh, that was actually okay. Huh! 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 Gone! Oh, yeah, you won't do it unless I force you to. It's a good idea, really, that they added it because, like, the amount of times I spazzed out and fell off was unbelievable. Here we go. You're alright, aren't you? Doing all right. Hey, 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 hey. There we go. There we go. Sequence one. Refresher course. Oh my lord. Levels look good now. You should be able to build the world. Time to find out what the temple wants from you. That's not Connor. Yay! I got a trophy for being awesome. I don't look like Connor, I look like a weird man. Sir. In fact, I look like, um... Sir. Everything all right, sir? Yes, fine. I'm just preoccupied, that's all. Maybe I'm Connor's dad. Master Birch will be meeting you inside. Thank you. Good. Where shall I retrieve you once you're done? In front of the Opera House. And be quick about it. Don't expect to be here long. I'll bring her round at once. Oh, thank you. Uh, I think. God, I feel like I'm becoming James Bond. Bond, James Bond. Birch. James Birch. Ah, here we go. Beautiful. Invitation, please. Yeah, I don't need one, dude. Shall I take your coat, sir? No, no, thank you. I'm quite all right. I don't need your stinking service. I've got an email. Ladies and gentlemen, you are requested to kindly find your seat. Well, okay, sure. I will find my seat in the opera house. This is very nice. Good evening, sir. This way, please. Oh, God. What am I? Oh, okay. I'm in. Oh, I. I... Uh, my apologies. I'm sorry. Sorry. S sorry, um, sorry, God, I'm really sorry. S sorry. There we go. Evening, Haytham. Haytham? Reginald? I can't tell you how happy I was to hear they'd mounted this revival. Gay's best work by far. Have you seen it before? Once. My father brought me here as a child. Though I remember little of it. I don't suppose tonight will afford me the luxury of a proper viewing either. Oh dear. No, I'm afraid it won't. On to business then. Do you see him? What? What? Ooh. Oh no, it is, isn't it? 
Oh no. Ah, there we go. I just have to sort of twiddle about a little bit. Like me too, he acts in a double capacity. Both against Rhodes and for. He's seated in one of the boxes above. The stairs are watched. You'll need to find another way out. Oh, well that's that's a Okay. Oh, I already have. I already have. Right. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm sorry. 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 No, just yeah. You stay there. Sorry. I'm just going to pop up here. Do -do 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 -do. Up we go. Forty pounds. Can I go up there? No, I can't. Where am I going? I don't bloody know. If I'm going around here, surely everyone's going to see me. Yes, yes, they bloody well are. What a stupid idea. Oh look, darling, there's a man climbing up here. Excuse me. Hello, don't mind me. Can I go up here? Oh, maybe I can. Surely not. No, I'm going to keep going this way. Ah, and then I'll go up here. What a terribly good idea. Don't mind me. Sorry. Sorry. Off we go. And then we go this way. Someone would bloody notice this, wouldn't they? I'd notice. Up we go. And then we go this way. And then we go round into the, the the box that's quiet and no one's here. Find a way backstage. Well, I will pick the lock. Thank you very much. I hope I don't have to actually physically pick. Oh, God, I do. Oh, dear God. Oh, Jesus, sodding. Oh no, this is going to end in tears. I mean, look, I can't do this. Ah! And then press R1 repeatedly to break the lock. Wow, okay. I can now pick locks. Okay, whoop! Oh my... Oh! Jesus! Uh Oh, that way. Of course. Of course. I'm blind as a bat. Oh, I bet it will. Oh, where are we going? Oh, we're going up here. Up we go. And then we go sideways onto the moon. Good God. Oh, yes, he is a mob. Yes, yes, she is. That is partly the best thing about this being set in America. I can take the piss out of my own accent. It's not an issue. Hello, I'm here to kill you. But well, I'm going to sit and talk to you first because I am a proper English gentleman. I mean, I'm going to sit behind you. Hey, Ethel. You should have come to me. We would have found another way. There's someone behind me. They're going to see the whole yes. bully thing. But then you would have known. For what it's worth, I'm sorry. As am I. Oh, God, I'm going to stab you through the chair and take your necklace. And the small child just saw me. Shit. Hello. You didn't see anything. Oh, fucking hell, that's really creepy. Hello, ladies. You're going to start screaming, aren't you? That was a little creepy. Off we go. Do, 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 do. I'm going to walk quite quickly. I've got... Come, please! Over there. Oh no, what's happened? A murder? Caesar. Oh god! A man was killed in the upper balcony! Oh, I've done my. no wrong! I search it! Any weapons? Oh no. 
What a, uh, what a shame. I beg your pardon. They fight. They don't push it. God. Quickly. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Um... Dear, oh dear. Excuse me. Sorry. 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 S sorry. Sorry. Thank you. I beg your pardon. I, I'm very late. I'm very. I'm very late. I must. I must go. Oh, good lord. I think I just shoved him. Or maybe I shoved. Maybe they shoved him. I'm not sure. Get out of here. Where are you going? Ah, where are you going? Excuse me, madam. Oh god, am I gonna have to fight my way out in a minute? Potentially, yes. Oh god, here we go. Oh, the door's so close. I'm not gonna be able to do it, am I? Shit's gonna go down. Excuse me, sorry, so sorry, sorry, thank you, sorry, sorry. Thank you for bringing it around, sir. Uh, not sir. Uh, the person. Or not a sir. And how was the opera? Rather dull, truth be told. What the bugger is that? Is that the key? Shall we be off then? Aye. To Fleet and Bride. There's a... By your command. A weird little thing. Whatever it is. 